Hey, 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 y'all, what's happening? Uh, welcome to my channel, T Grown Magic Hero. Yeah, yeah. Here to do a reading for my beautiful Gemini and my wonderful collective family. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody is doing well. Yes, I do. Sending everybody love, light, and healing energy, okay? Uh, keep in mind, you already know what it do, okay? Only take the energy that fits for you. Flip it if you need to. Everything is not about you. It's not going to resonate with everybody. It can't because it's a general reading. Okay, baby? Choir, come, come. <clears throat> One, two, three. Oh, T-Girl, T-Girl, magic and collective. T-Girl, 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 magic and collective. T-Girl, T-Girl, magic and collective. Project us out and see what we're about. Ooh, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. We sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Right? Okay, give the choir a round of applause. That's what's up. All right, Holy Spirit, ancestors, ascended masters of the highest white light. What's going on with Gemini energy? Uh oh, imbalances. Somebody could be juggling, feeling a little bit imbalanced. They could be juggling finances, okay? But I feel more emotional. I feel like it's both, honestly. Somebody, um, somebody's sacral chakra is off, okay? Yeah, that orange. Whatever the chakra of orange is, which I believe is the soul, is it the sacral? Because there's yellow and orange here. So if their sacral and solar plex chakras are in balance right now, they could be having a hard time creating, okay, or with willpower moving forward. Somebody's feeling lost at sea completely, okay? Somebody is, I don't know, they feel like you're getting away. Somebody's behind you. I'm trying, I don't know. But then, yeah, they're spying on you. Okay, they're spying on you and they're feeling some kind of way because maybe they're not moving forward or what's going on, spirit? Heart, is this car? Okay, these, are these in reverse or what's going on, spirit? Okay, this fell out in reverse. So somebody is in balance because they see that you are out of some type of heartbreak. I'm sorry, baby. They see you are in some type of heartbreak. See, they're spying Someone's looking or spying or studying. Maybe some of you guys are having a hard time at school. Some of you guys are in school. And you're maybe you're having a hard time with the curriculum, okay? Maybe you're having a hard time traveling to school. I don't know. It's a lot. You're trying to juggle a lot between work, school, family life, and all of that. So you're kind of like off balance right now. But this is someone looking at you to see if you are imbalanced. And they see that you are not in a three of swords you are out of the three of swords absolutely possibly this person was thinking about coming towards you and then they know they can't come towards you maybe that's an imbalance because like i said you're getting away it looks seemed like somebody was after you see these boats in the back this is little boat and big boat okay you're the little boat getting away and they heard somebody in the background thinking they were bigger i'm getting somebody was trying to bully you and because they, like, by cause, because, by cause, ooh, child, they could be by, I don't know, I don't know, it is what it is, but they could be bullying you and spying to see, are you in heartbreak? They're trying to stop something, stop something from moving forward. Now, the Knight of Cups in reverse is emotionally manipulative. Now, he could be emotionally manipulative, upright, or, but in the reverse, he's even worse, okay? He's definitely noncommittal. So anyway, they see that you've released something, and you've made a judgment call. Oh, wow. You made a judgment call, call on this Knight of Cups in reverse. Mm -hmm. This person, is there. I can already see their immaturity. And that's another reason why you made a judgment call. Because this person is very immature. They, they are non-committal. They can't finish. They can't finish anything that they start. Okay, they, they do a lot of more talking than action. Okay, they're wish-washy, they go with the flow. I mean, they don't even go with the flow, they go with the wind. 
and they value the opinions of other people. So one day they're solid and then somebody else will say something or somebody says something about something that, you know, that I don't know that they agree with or don't agree with. They'll, sh they'll shift, they'll switch up and change their mind. Okay, this person could be bipolar as well. <sighs> but high priestess. You already knew. You got intuitive downloads about this wish-washy person. Yeah, they're too wish-washy. God was telling you this person is not solid. Nine of cups in reverse. They're not solid. They keep you in third-party situations, though. You had to remove yourself from that. And when I mean remove yourself from that, that's the death card. So you ended something. While someone, So after you ended something with this page of swords energy or whoever this person is, they probably did something behind the scenes to cause an imbalance to you, but you caught it ahead of time with your high priestess ass. And you know how to transmute that energy, Transformers, and you probably pop that shit back. So they sit here trying to see, did it, uh, is it affecting your ass? And they need to be worried about their own self, because no, they under judgment right now. Look, 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 look. Mm -hmm. They didn't know, honey. They didn't know that shit was going to hit their ass. Okay. Yeah, they didn't know. Could be a cancer. Doesn't have to be. But this person is fearful. Or what are they? What is this moon spirit? What is this moon holy spirit? An illusion. They tried to send an illusion that popped right back to them. That's all magic is an illusion. This whole world is an illusion. Nothing is as it seems. Everything is in motion, always moving. Nothing's really solid, if that's making sense. So, yeah. And they didn't expect you to be no high priestess either. Okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah, and that's why their ass is in balance, because that's why the first card. So somebody is shaken up. They cannot believe, honey, that you haven't had some type of rebirth, or they can't believe you the high priestess, or they're upset you're the high priestess, or they're... Things are ending for them and they couldn't figure out what had happened. And then now they realize that they're under judgment and whatever they did was an illusion. Because spirit kept telling them that they asked to hold. Look, I wouldn't do that if I was you, boy. Could be a Leo. This, this Leo is in balance right now. Okay? Because you are strength. Okay? I wouldn't do that if I were you. I wouldn't take action because you're going to be in your fucking feelings if you do. Okay? Because this was some type of... I tried to, so I feel like you being the high priestess, God tried to hand you this person. I don't know what, Spirit, why is this person, why is, tell me, I just, they walked away. And Spirit told them to walk away. You're going to be in your feelings, buddy. I suggest you ask, walk away. Because my baby's magical too. Okay. Mm. Or you will take some type of action and they will go to be the ones left out in the cold. Because I'm telling you, the Queen of Wands is confident as every everything. Yes. Not only are you high priestess, you're the your empress is here already. I didn't even got to see the empress. The empress is here. And you used your magic, Queen of Wands. Because God told him, if you don't, you better walk away. You're going to be in your emotions and you're going to be feeling left out in the cold. If you do, you're going to get left out if you continue to move forward. Spirit told they asked to walk away. Please walk away from this Queen of Wands energy. Now, for some of y'all, it could be a Queen of Wands energy that was doing this to you. Okay, however this goes in secret. So it could have been the person that you once were with, that you left behind, that got with this Queen of Wands. She got mad and she's sending magic to you. Okay, but anyways, but I'm getting more... A masculine energy in his feminine Queen of Wands energy sending magic to your home for some of you guys but you walked away from that shit you like bitch fuck you uh, high priestess knows that that's a nose when somebody's trying to cause an imbalance yeah that that's a nose and so honey you know how to transmute so they're sitting here spying to see whatever they did did it work bitch no it didn't work so they could be defeated because queen of swords is standing strong tall and long okay you hear me you ready for war you stay war ready like Rick Ross. Okay, y'all will listen to that song where Rick Ross. It's kind of it's kind of hood. It'll get you hyped. You know what I mean? But hey, you stay war, you stay war ready. But I am feeling that this is somebody in your family or somebody you used to have a family with, or even somebody you were married to that you walked away from. 
okay? And you left this family unit. You walked away from this family reunion or you got away from the family unit and your family's pissed off at you. That you, how dare you fucking leave me? How dare you fucking leave me? You left me stranded. You left me stranded. I mean, I hope this ain't no whole grown ass man. I did say it's a bitch man. No, no offense, men, I love you. You know what I mean. You know what I'm, them kind of men. I ain't talking about you, so you shouldn't even be offended by it. You should be like, yeah, that's right, these bitch ass men. <laughs> It's one that's depending on you, woman. So if you're a masculine, it's a bitch-ass man depending on you. And if it's a woman, it's a bitch-ass man depending on you, period, period, okay? They stuck. They like, help me, help me. I want to help too. Like, you don't have time for that, Gemini. And it is somebody from your past having all these nostalgic memories and feelings. And please come back. And I love you. And... Um, you guys have a lot of history or they could be, I don't know. You're just, you're, look at you. You don't want anybody from the past. Look, you're like, nobody from the past. Nobody from the past. It's, you, you closing out cycles from everybody from the past, Gemini, and moving straight full steam ahead. I ain't mad at you, brother or sister, because it's all about your happiness, poo. It's all about you and what you want in your happiness and what you're trying to master, manifest, and create in your life. Okay, King of Swords. Now, this is the good King of Swords, okay? Just Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, to your Ten of Cups. Perfect. Oh, but I'm going to tell you, this King of Swords or whoever this energy is, they want the Ten of Cups with your ass. Queen of Cups, that's you. They want you, okay? They want to have kids by you or they want to... They want another opportunity. They're bored. They're mad. They're pouting. They're angry. They could be sick. It's a lot going on with this energy that's imbalanced. And you know when somebody is spiritually imbalanced, they are physically imbalanced in every way. And the reason that they are physically imbalanced is because they've been doing, they've been sending magic to this Queen of Swords. They've been sending magic to this Queen of Swords, to her home, her stability, or his stability, to leave him out in the cold and poverty. They're doing that. I'm also picking up right now, there is a Queen of Wands. That's with this air sign energy that's doing magic on you to get you poor and poverty so this man won't come towards you. Okay, but they, child, yeah, but this person's going to fight. I don't know if you want them, though. Yeah, he's got a lot of love. A lot of love. He's in love with you. Whoever you are, he's in love with you. Mm-hmm. And that's a secret. But, yeah. But he wants to work. Oh, they want to work on this two of cups, though. But I, I need to figure out how you feel. And Gemini, you're, he's all in his head about it, too. He wants to work out this two of cups energy. Please, let's work it out. I'm, I, need to, I need to explain some things to you. Because this person is in their head by the action that they have taken. As far as being wish-washy and not solid with you and going to some, like, it doesn't matter how this person feels. I really don't feel it doesn't matter at the end of the day. The damage has already been done. Whatever is needed to be seen, it's been shown. And so this is why this person is literally in their head as well, okay? Um... Yeah, they got a lot. Oh, somebody, honey, somebody's addicted to you or obsessed with you or something. But I'm just telling you, I don't know. This energy doesn't know what they are or who they want. They are bisexual. I'm looking at the card right now. Child, oh, Lord, have mercy. But they love you, though. They're, I mean, it is what it is. I mean, if they could be faithful to you, but I don't know. This person was not a faithful person in the beginning. And when you start off wrong, you end off wrong. But this person wants to marry you. They want to marry you. That's the truth. They want to marry you and they're obsessed with you. Yep, that's justice. They feel like that's this will balance themselves out. But they still, they, I don't know. There's some type of obsession, obsessed father figure, king of pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo that is obsessed with you that thinks that you belong to them. You belong to me. You belong. So, and for some of y'all, they went. There's a queen of pentacles and an empress. They came. Okay, so somebody can't choose who they want. That's the problem. This king of pentacles or air sign or whoever, 
they can't choose who they want. They want the both. Some of them, they got three. They got the Empress, the Queen of Wands, and the Queen of Pentacles. They don't know who to walk away from. Because they feel like all y'all, they soulmate. Oh, hell fuck no. Nah. Spirit say that's the truth. They think everybody's their happiness. So that's what I'm saying. This this, this, this is going to leave, baby. Going to leave this person behind. I think you have already left them behind because you're not even focused on this person. You're too busy focused on your kingdom, running things, building things, your empire. You're too busy working. And that's where it should stay, baby. Okay? So, yeah. It's just now a missed opportunity. But, um... Yeah, that's what's in your energy right now, now, okay? So, if you, whoever this is resonating with, just know, um, they're still undecided. They are still undecided, and they still like Panene. They like that Pene. Ping, 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 ping. Sorry. I just, you know, I just, hey. Spirit said that's what they like. Whatever you like. So, they're going to try to balance it out and want to be with you. But really, deep down inside themselves, they really like that that one. You know what I mean? They like that one. Duh. And this is why they're mentally entrapped. Because they love you too, but they like that one too, honey. And they don't know. Ooh, they don't know. Okay, they don't know. But I feel like a king of pentacles in an air sign or a Scorpio or somebody, honey. They creeping around in the back and they the child. Duh. Oh, child. Okay. Spirit, anything else? Anything else? Let me go to a fairy oracle. Lord, have mercy. Honey, there is too much. Ooh, something caused the argument. So, I don't know what the fuck happened. Somebody, I don't know if this queen of wands caused something. Somebody done did something to lay something to rest. Caused this tower. Somebody's in regret and somebody's obsessed with somebody else. Because somebody... Oh, hell, we got another man obsessed with another man, child. So if the man is in love with a woman, this male lover is fucking in competition with you. I don't know how. Ladies, you can't compete with Pinini. You don't have one. And you don't have a prostate either. Okay? This man, honey, let me tell you, he like, this man is popping that prostate too tight. Okay? He got obsessed and addicted to it. Lord, Ooh, yeah, honey. He like, mm, mm you ain't go. Child, so you got somebody obsessed with you, and then there's another lover, same-sex lover, King of Pentacles energy specifically, that's either obsessed with you or, no. Okay, I'm, there's two different King of Pentacles in the energy, okay. One of the King of Pentacles spirits said, okay, because that's picking up that energy. Okay, I got it. It's your baby daddy. And then the other King of Pentacles it's not your baby daddy, but it's like this air sign, cancer, Scorpio sign or fire sign. It's their lover who's the female, but it's the same sex male lover who's jealous of you. Is that making sense? Okay. So anyway, and they're angry because they feel this person is their two of cups and this person's laying things to rest with them because they feel like it was built on a faulty foundation. Like it's too much going on. Oh, there's too many obsessed lovers. Too many obsessed lovers and the king of pentacles keep coming out. So there's another man out there that like, I mean, he is all in his head or somebody's in, head, in their head about a king of pentacles. Take it how it goes. It doesn't have to be same sex. It could be, you know, heterosexual, but I'm getting this heavily. Because the wand keep child goodbye. I'm out of here, Gemini. I hope you have a wonderful day. Love you. Bye.